it was a case of how can two things be related? There's art, and then there is social work, and, and then there's this. To be fair, I mean, I have had my uh, low days where I've had, I've talked about that, you know, but so does everyone, I'm sure, but uh, I, I have, like, seriously thought about maybe getting into the same profession. Uh, they had expectations for me, but I knew that I, I could not help them in, in any, any way. And um, things like that made me have a, a different approach on the project and, and made me realize that it's not about changing people's life and it's not about interfering in people's life. It's about bringing it to people's notice so that people know what's going on and, and people know that uh, the solution to the problems. And when people start backing out and, and like uh, not showing in first eye, I started to test them a bit and uh, went to strangers places, went to people that I have met before and uh, it, it was really hard because people sometimes wouldn't even open the door on you and, and they would be like, you know, no, we, and, and treat you like a, they, they would ask you to explain things from outside which is, which is, I know how to do it is because I have tried it and I have tried it, it doesn't work, that no, doesn't work and then they, they come and kind of tell you to go away and then some of them you're there you know the door is open they're, they're there and they're, they're making fun of you that what, what are you doing and you know people telling you that you don't have a life and people just just be honest it, it, it makes you feel like that you are trying to kind of from I mean from their point of view, it'll be they probably think that I'm uh, I'm there for selling them some service, but I know that I'm not I'm not there to to make money or, or anything like that. But it just gives you a feeling of a salesman uh, going door to door and looking for people, talking to people, uh, and trying to explain them and trying to get their opinion. And uh, it, it's it's just like a salesman. That's what they do, salesman and marketing. That's exactly what they did, if, and and it was they, they were expecting something out of you, and it just you knew that you could not change their life, and at least not then and there. Maybe the work I'm doing would, but I couldn't change their life, and that was something that um, made me think. And it was a case of that, you know, it'll be cheating on them almost if I'm there or, and and not helping helping them. So if that all they care for is I'm there to help them. If I am there to, to look at them, it's, it's no good. And and it makes sense because although I, I was thinking that it's all corrupted, but it's not. It makes sense for them. You, they, the, the guy said to me that people come here, take pictures, and they money, make money outside by, by portraying this India. People are making money off their misery, and that is kind of a... The, the image that some of them have got and so even if someone tries to do something good for for just for the sake of it they wouldn't trust them they wouldn't trust them at that time i was thinking that that was the phase when i was thinking that i'm i'm not making a difference but after that i started to realize the fact that i'm i'm not here to make a difference i am it's, it's like media it's like news channels and if there is wrong, you can't just make it right. The world has to make it right. It's not just one person's responsibility or it's not an a, a NGO's responsibility. It's not an artist's responsibility. It's the responsibility of the whole world. And that's what we're doing. We are bringing it in front of the world. We are mapping it so that everyone can see we, we, and everyone can be motivated. Yeah, just like I have been. And I don't mind it. If this is ending soon, because if, if it goes somewhere, then that's all I get for. In fact, other other day, it doesn't really matter. As long as you know, uh, it gets somewhere, and it's, as long as people try, that's, that's all they can do. That's all. They can do. It's very easy to to just give your views, and it's uh, equally difficult to be uh, a part of it and, and try and change. Because people think that 
it doesn't really matter. They have lived like this for so long, and they will just live like that, and it doesn't really matter. She was the one actually who made fun of me, but uh, yeah, uh, it was. Uh, I I could understand from their point of view because they don't want to mix anymore. Maybe initially we we screwed it up that now that they're happy among themselves and, and they don't want to take an initiative because you know they're not missing anything. Maybe that is the right way to approach people by by not making them feel that you want something out of them. And uh, yeah, there is this this gap which you can't bridge over a conversation or over a month or over a year. You have to be really, really close to someone to be welcomed in their family, to, to take pictures of their house, to to record their conversations. It's, uh, it is just the level of, of trust. And uh, some of you guys have had a bad, bad experiences before, and and I, I suppose that uh, you just have to gain this trust. It's, it's not their fault because they think it's a waste of time, what uh, I'm doing. Uh, for them, they might as well just do something else. And you know, what is the punchline is what is there for them? Because uh, they, they can't get used to the fact that it can't. It is all for you, and it's all for their benefit. And uh, they they just looking for a for my motive. And there's this me who's turning up to, to people and saying that oh, I'm here to help you. And, to know you and, and and obviously they'll be they'll be surprised and, and shocked and rude to get rid of me. And what was my experience to 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 work as a virtual employee from like the UK and I think it's not about who you're working for, it's, it's about what you're working on and it's I, I, I as I told you that I've had my off days and uh, and when I have them it's just like oh, this is not going to work. I am going to be looking for more opportunities to, to work in this area because uh, it's not only uh, trying to help others, it's, it's you learning a lot, a lot, and you see things that motivate you and, and touch you, and they've always been there, and you have overlooked them every single time, and now you are doing, you're going into it, and you're trying to do something about it, and I think this is one job which has uh, quite motivated me, and uh, I'm sorry to say, but it's the money is not the motivation. It's it's the job this time. I told you the other day as well that I've been facing like problems, kind of uh, getting people's attention, and it's because I'm just one of them. I'm kind of this, you know. I'm just I look like them, and I'm I'm. It's just one of them. I'm one of the crowd for them. But staring in there thinking, what the, are they crazy? And that's what they, they call you. I swear, that's what people call people. I mean, now I can, my job title is international artist, so I can call myself an artist. But so, working a project like this, people call you stupid. I swear, I mean, I have, I've been called stupid. I mean, yes, I have. Because they just don't get the idea. They just, they, 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 there's this, I met someone who's like, a, uh, I'm not sure, he, this guy has told me, I'm not sure if these guys can make money out of their, this or not, but if they can't, then uh, it's, it's really stupid to come from a place where there's everything to, to, to see poverty and, and live, like, they still get this idea that uh, you know, people come and, and do this to feel better about themselves, so that they they think that they they are doing something good and then make themselves feel better. You know, if if you mean satisfying themselves, I mean, I don't know if I make sense to you. Know.